Attackmate Corporation is a software company which focuses on secure terminal emulation, legacy integration, and managed file transfer software. It is a subsidiary of the British software company Microfocus International. Products As a result of mergers and acquisitions the company includes several brands. Equals terminal emulation equals, Attackmate develops a variety of terminal emulators, reflection, extra. InfoConnect. Equals managed file transfer equals. File XPRESS managed file transfer solutions help users securely transfer files of any size, across all major platforms, to any location. Equals secure communications equals, reflection for secure IT, formerly F secure SSH, is an SSH client and server for Windows and Unix. Equals application integration equals, Attackmate Veristream provides application integration tools that quickly and non-invasively service enable mainframe and enterprise host data and logic. Attackmate Data Bridge is an extract, transform, load solution for securely integrating Unisys DMSI and non-DMSI data to a secondary database such as Oracle or Microsoft SQL Server. Equals PCX Server equals Reflection X allows Windows users to use graphical and command line based applications on remote Unix, Linux, and open VMS hosts. History. Equals Attackmate Corporation equals Attackmate, founded in 1982 by Frank W. Pratt and Julia Pratt, focused initially on the IBM terminal emulation market and became a major technology employer in the Seattle area. Based in Bellevue, Washington. The company became one of the largest PC software companies in the world, with offices in more than 50 cities in North America and in 30 countries. The company made several acquisitions, through mergers and purchases, to expand its range of host access hardware and software solutions. Attackmate served 80% of Fortune 500 and Global 2000 companies, with over 13 million users worldwide. Attackmate's major development locations included their headquarters in Bellevue, an office in Bellingham, Washington, and a facility in Cincinnati, Ohio. In the early days, Attackmate focused on 3270 emulation for PCs with some hardware 3270 boards as well. Attackmate invested heavily in its sales and marketing organization worldwide in the early 90s and quickly grew its market share from third in the host connectivity market to first with its extra personal client product. The company continued to grow organically as well as through acquisition of KEA Systems and DCA. Later, the company also acquired the Wollongong Group. After the acquisition of DCA, the company quickly dominated the 3270, 5250 and VT marketplace, and built its revenues in excess of $400 million in 1995, as compared to roughly $40 million just five years earlier. A senior management transition led by incoming CEO Jim Lingner made an attempt to create a unified product strategy and take the company public. The strategy received positive reviews from customers and the press initially but eventually stalled as a clash between pre- and post-DCA merger management destabilized product development and Frank Pratt took back the helm in July 1996. Bill Boisvert, formerly of Packer, was the next president from January 1998 until his resignation in October 2000 after a year of layoffs and flat revenue growth. The next stage of its history was marked by tight fiscal management and managing to the bottom line. As revenues were impacted through the bursting tech bubble after 2001, Attackmate was hit with successive rounds of layoffs. In 2001, the Burnaby Development Center was closed. In June 2002 the Cincinnati Development Center was closed and the company's VP of Development was fired. On April 18, 2005, it was announced that three investment companies, Golden Gate Capital, Francisco Partners, and Tom Acrezzi Equity Partners, would buy Attackmate. Attackmate would be merged with longtime competitor WRQ, whom the investors had bought previously. Attackmate no longer sells or supports 3270 IRMA, SDLC, or ISCA SDLC hardware adapters, or provides driver downloads. In February 2007, they sold their remaining hardware inventory to Alpine Computer Systems, 
a legacy equipment reseller, and refers customers to them for sales and service on hardware adapters and drivers. Equals WRQ, Incorporated equals, in 1981, Doug Walker, Mike Richer and Marty Quinn founded Walker, Ritchie and Quinn to integrate microcomputers with existing IT environments. The company set its sights on the Hewlett Packard market, launching the first commercially viable terminal emulator for the HP 3000. Based in Seattle, Washington, WRQ was one of the 20 largest software companies, and consistently ranked in Fortune magazine a Euro unregistered trademark SA Euro A100 best companies to work for in America. A Euro and Washington CEO magazine a Euro unregistered trademark SA Euro OE best companies to work for a Euro. Two companies, Express Metrics and Netmotion Wireless, were spun off by WRQ in 2000 and 2001, respectively, and are operating successfully today. On December 6, 6 2004 it was announced that WRQ had been purchased by an investment group consisting of Francisco Partners. Golden Gate Capital and Tom Acrezi Equity Partners. Equals Attackmate and WRQ merger equals, the same investment group proceeded to buy Attackmate as well. The agreement for the sale was made on April 18, 2005. WRQ and Attackmate had been long-time competitors in the host emulation business when it was announced that the companies would be merged. The merger was completed on October 3, 2005 and the new company was named Attackmate. In June 2005, shortly after the merger was made official, Attack Network announced that its corporate headquarters would be located in WRQ Seattle, Washington location. The vacated headquarters of Attackmate in the Factoria neighborhood of Bellevue, Washington were quickly filled by T-Mobile, who already occupied part of the building. The company continued to support both Attackmate and WRQ product sets until products could be merged or replaced. Equals NetIQ acquisition equals NetIQ, founded in 1995 by Ching Fa Wang, Ha Honorable Wong, Ken Pryun Cheng, and Thomas A. Kemp, was a company that provided systems management and security management software. It provided businesses worldwide with solutions to monitor, analyze, and optimize the performance, availability, and security of IT infrastructure. Its flagship products included APP Manager and Security Manager. The company headquarters were in San Jose, California, with about 900 employees worldwide. Their NASDAQ ticker symbol was NTIQ. NetIQ's toolset included systems, security, BOIP and administration software. On April 27, 2006, Attack Network announced an agreement to acquire NetIQ for about 495 million US dollars, and that the deal would close in 90 days. NetIQ would be merged into Attack Network, creating a single company with 400 million dollars annual revenue and over 40,000 customers in 60 countries. On June 20, they announced that NetIQ shareholders had approved this purchase, and the acquisition would be complete by the end of that month. On July 5, 2006, both companies released a press release announcing the closing of the deal. The new company would do business under the name Attackmate Corporation. Equals on demand acquisition and sale equals, on March 7, 2006, Attackmate announced that they had acquired on demand software. On demand software develops an award winning product called Win Install, which is for desktop management in IT environments. This product is similar to Attack Network's existing NetWizard product. On June 30, 2008, Scalable Software announced in a press release that they had acquired the Win Install business unit from Attackmate. Equals Novell acquisition equals Novell announced in November 2010 that it had agreed to be acquired by Attackmate for $2.2 billion. On April 27, 2011, the Attackmate group announced the completion of the acquisition of Novell, Inc a leader in intelligent workload management, under the terms of the definitive agreement disclosed on November 22, 2010. On May 2, 2011, immediately following the sale, Attackmate laid off hundreds of Novell employees. Novell now operates as two separate business units under the Novell and SUSE brand names and joins Attackmate and NetIQ as holdings of the Attackmate group.
Certain intellectual property assets are planned to be sold to CPTN Holdings, a consortium of companies led by Microsoft. Equals acquisition by Microfocus equals, on September 15, 2014, the British firm Microfocus International announced that it would acquire the Attackmate Group for US$1.2 billion US dollars in shares. References External links, official website, Attackmate file library, archive.org, Jeff Horn's Crunchbase, Crunchbase.